Hi guys, so this is a continuation video in relation to why you should enroll for a degree in early child care and education. So when you're talking about early child care and education, we're talking about children from back to six or back to eight, depends on the context of the country where you're based. For myself, I'm based in the Republic of Ireland. So here for us, early childhood is for children from back to six. So now let's talk about some of the reasons why you should enroll for a degree in early child care and education. You'll be learning about how to work with children, how to work with the community, child, family, and community. You'll be learning about parental engagement, parental involvement, how to involve the parent, promote their children's holistic care and education. You'll be learning about historical and philosophical perspectives. You'll be learning about the history of early childhood care and education in the country that you're based in, how early childhood is and how it is now. You'll be learning more about policies, up-to-date policies in early childhood care and education. So you'll be looking at policies, legislations in relation to early childhood care and education from the inception of early childhood care and education in the country that you're based in. Looking at policies before the invention of early childhood care and education and recent policies in relation to early childhood care and education to keep you up to date in relation to what's going on in early childhood care and education because policies will influence your work in the real world. I often say to people that in early childhood, you're going to be driven by policies. Policies tell us what to do, the adult ratios, how the children should be, how to promote holistic care and education of this student. All of this is being driven by policies. So you'll be chewing policies a lot. You'll be learning it in and out of policies and how you can apply this into the real world situations. It's not just all about learning about the policies. How are you going to apply them into real life situations? So you'll be learning about this. You'll be learning about creative hacks, how to be creative. You know, in the real world, when you're working with young children, you have to be creative in relation to ideas. You'll be teasing out all of this, implementing your creativity skills has proven that we're all born with skills, which include creativity skills. So when you enroll for that degree in early childhood care and education, you will be utilizing your creativity skills, which you'll be applying in real life situations. You'll be learning about how to, you know, use settings, how to work as a member of a team. All of this is part of what you're going to be learning when you enroll for the degree in early childhood care and education. There's a lot that you stand to gain when you enroll for the degree in early childhood care and education. As a parent as well, it's going to be beneficial to you. I remember when I did my degree in early childhood care and education, it helps me, you know, in relation to my dealings with my children. So if you're a parent as well, go for the degree in early childhood care and education. It's not going to be useful for you in your professional life even also in your personal life in your dealings with the children as well it's going to bed into you now that i've highlighted some of the reasons why you should go for the degree in early childhood i'm going to encourage you go for that degree you stand a lot to contribute into the community you know you're building the foundations of the young lives you know you're nurturing no lives. this is what early childhood is all about look at it as you're going to be planting that seed you are the first point of contact that the children will come in contact with apart from their home. So you're going to be planting that seed. You're going to be building that foundation for others to build on. So I'll encourage you to enroll for that degree in early childhood care and education. And if you find this video helpful, please kindly subscribe and not just subscribe, turn on that notification bell so that whenever a new video is being dropped on this channel, you'll be the first person to be notified. And until I come your way next time, stay safe and mind yourselves for now. Bye.